Okay, I'm out here um, sharpening chains, and I thought I'd sharpen the chain on my uh, little battery-powered uh, still here. This thing's great to put on the lawnmower, and uh, just ride around as you find something that needs to cut, just whack it off. It's better than toting a chainsaw with you. But um, I did take this little uh, flapper off, and uh, I had to go get me a file. This takes a one-eighth file little bitty file but um and i've been sharpening some other chains and i thought it was uh probably time to do a a chain test so we're going to take the uh 550 down there we're going to run a steel chain a husky chain a organ chain and probably a forester chain and uh see what kind of cut times we get on those all these chains have been used and sharpened so um they should be uh, pretty close. None of them is brand new. Okay. First up is going to be the uh, steel chain. Uh, it is a full comp chain. And the saw should be warm. So let's, uh, let's give it a go. Next up is going to be the uh, organ chain, PXL. Now I'm, I'm not going to know what these times are until I hit it. I can tell you, my favorite chain is the. Um, Steel. Good way, Skeeter. Okay, next up will be the uh, Husky. be the forester. Okay, next up will be the uh, Forester Pro chain. That felt real good. So, uh, like I say, I won't know the um, times until I edit the video. <clears throat> but uh, let's go back up here. And, uh, I cut this tree down because the uh, bugs is in it. I want to get a want to get it out, but we're pretty good ways down in the woods. Might tear up a good bit of stuff trying to get it out. So. But, just playing around today, let's uh, go back up to the shop. So in closing here, I did put the um, steel chain back on it, um, which I still don't know. I won't know the uh, times until I edit. Um, they all felt pretty good. Um, I was kind of surprised at that Forrester chain. Um, but um, we'll just have to edit and see what the times are. Um, thanks for watching.